Oh, me? Oh, I'm just a full-fledged professional coordinating adult. We are on set today of a commercial for The Boob Company, which is the winners of the Fiverr contest I did a little while ago. It's so dope because if you know me, you know I hate bras and I don't know what to do with my boobs. So this is like speaking to me in so many different ways. How do you get it about the boobs, right? I 100% get it about the boobs. The sweat. What are you doing? Just working. Quality work. Thank you. Guess who else is here? Oh, no. <laughs> so one thing about me that people don't know is I'm actually very insecure the day after I wash my hair because my hair is so like fluffy, but it like, gets frizzy. So like the day after I wash my hair, I'm always just like, is my hair okay? Like I've asked seven people, is my hair okay? Because it's just out of control. I'm so insecure about it. But is my hair okay, real talk? Is there lollies sticking out anywhere? That's why I prefer my hair big out of the braids because that's like messy and it's like, oh, it's, all, it's not supposed to be messy. I'm so stressed, I'm gonna get my period, I can't. Okay, so out of the hundreds of entries I got, the winner of the Fiverr Pro gig was... What's your name? Me, it's Paola. I know and what you're I, thinking. Uh, She's beautiful and you're right. She is beautiful. I'm standing next to her in person. I'm shook. Thank you so What's much. your company name? The Boot Company. And what do you guys do? Breast lift in a box. Okay, so basically tell me. It's supposed to be replacing like duct tape. When people try to use duct tape, right? Basically, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and I nice. hate bras. So tell me right. like how I will benefit from this. Because I actually believe in this product. When I went through all the entries, I was like, I would use this. This is a problem. I want to support them. She said I could have a lifetime supply. It is amazing. What are the best? Is it like when you're wearing a top that you can't figure out how to wear a bra? Is that what, the, what it is? For example, like mm -hmm. when you're wearing like a very like plunge like neckline, mm -hmm. you can just wear this tape. Mm -hmm. um, it's a breast, like I said, it's a breast stuff in a box. And, and it's like latex free. Latex free. What are all the stats? Hypoallergenic. It's penis removal. And Waterproof. it lasts all day. So yeah. your sweaty boob sweat, Kyle knows all about that. It's, it's a proof <laughs> against all of that. Where's the box? Let's show the box. And how did you design the box? I designed it on Fiverr. Everything was and designed on Fiverr. And that's true. That wasn't even a talking point. She's just legit. That's the and I, I really designed everything on Fiverr. That's awesome. I'm so happy for you. So when is this so like going to be like available, available? Available for pre-order mm -hmm. now at theboobcompany.com. I'll put it in the description as well. But yo, it's dope as hell. You got boobies. Link in the description. She's dope. <laughs> Thank you. We're having a great time. <laughs> Fancy, it's my first time getting taken for a <laughs> right, just got to John's office. Let's hit the writer's room. Thus far, every time I enter the writer's room, I always, like, I'm very alarming and jarring. I'm never calm. I'm always like, <laughs> and I scare the crap out of them. Let's go. Emily had a heart attack. <laughs> you okay? You breathing? <laughs> you sure I scared you? No, I was like, oh, lovely. <laughs> Link in the description, but here's a little sneak peek. Sneak peek is not the right word. Here's a little teaser is not the right word. Here's a clip of my video with Hassan Minaj. What's my vibe? Your vibe is this. I'm gonna look at you. Okay. I'm gonna talk. Okay. I'm gonna get really intense when I talk. Okay. I'm gonna throw a little side thing. A little, oh, there's a joke. Oh, you didn't even see it coming. Okay. I'm gonna hold that stare. Okay. Just to make sure you're on the same page as me. Alright. I'm gonna look at the camera. This is terrifying. Every spare moment of today is going towards one thing and one thing only, and that is clearing my inbox because it is a disaster. And so every opportunity, emails, emails, emails of like all types of stuff. Girl love, NBC show, some Olay stuff, some Unicorn Island stuff, some team stuff, some merch stuff, some receipts from shopping. <clears throat> what? Who said that? Some paying people stuff. Yeah, apparently people want to get paid. Life is crazy. Productive, productive. I had a set design meeting. The set design is really coming along, but it's also like splitting my brain into 14,000 different pieces because I don't know, okay? I don't know. Doing all the work. So I think it's just a cool experience to be able to share with y'all like the building of my late night show. And thus far, I've had to really pick and choose what I can show you and can't show you because I don't want to show you things that are not confirmed yet in terms of people I'm working with or like certain designs and certain concepts I'm working with. When things are locked in, I'll begin to share them with you because I think this is like really cool. This is our journey. How many other late night shows have you seen like from the ground up how they've been built and what the trials and tribulations have been? So I think today I feel like I'm in a place that I want to introduce you to my writers and I'm so excited because I adore them all. They're such great vibes, great energy and they went through the process of meeting me and going through my vibes test. I feel like they're from all walks of life and have so many different points of views and perspectives. So I'm excited I to introduce you to A Little Late with Lily Singh's Writers. Am I supposed to look straight at the camera? What am yeah. I doing? <laughs> <That's just laughs> I'm like looking at the fuzzy mic and that's not right. <laughs> Lily is probably the nicest, most positive human being I've ever met in my entire life. For real, not like for play. You working for me? What yeah. you working on? Right. That's cool. I like that. <laughs> Just that she's like a ball of light and energy. What's going on? What are you working on? I'm working on a beat sheet for you. Oh, a a pre-tape. <laughs> that was really hard to type. You 
get that and under underline it. Boom, check. Boom, 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 check. You're doing a great job. Thank you. You're doing a great job. I'm, 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 I have to put that up for you still. I'm, I'm, I'm it's fine. I have so much to do list. so many things, <laughs> many things to do. She knows exactly what she wants to do, but she somehow gets that information across to you in a way that is kind. Are you trying to hide from me? No. <laughs> no, it's a perfectly normal place to work. What do you mean? How are you? Working on refillable guest bits right refillable now. Refillable guest bits. That's right. It's for <gasps> celebrities to do recurring on the show. How fun! I love it. It's you have phenomenal fun. writing, also. Oh, thank you. What are these? Um, this is for because um, my elderly wrists need a place to rest <laughs> on my very hard computer. And it keeps them from hurt. I don't know. You're I doing just, great. More You're connecting with the millennials really that watch this like this. Gen Z God. is screaming right now. When will this end? Okay. <laughs> I think Lily is like Oprah. You're doing great, buddy. You're doing great. You look good. Can I do this? Can I pull off a backwards hat? Let me hat? see. Uh -huh. I have to walk in and evaluate. Hold on. Just have it act natural. Sick hat! Oh, okay. Yeah! Sick hat! <laughs> Immediately turns it around. It turns it around. It felt uncomfortable. I felt too Fred Durst. So much fun. Such positivity. It just like knocks you over. It's really great. Hustle! 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 Harder! 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 I think it's because I've done comedy now for like 16 years. I've only met negative people. So anyone who's positive, which I rarely meet, is just Oprah to me. It's really fun to work somewhere where the people at the top are so fun and loving and positive because that can be a rare thing in this industry. So many great ideas for the show and just you can tell that she's really excited to do it. Very intuitive. Like you can just kind of see like she's looking like she's trying to figure out who you are. Jonathan! What's up? Uh, well, you in the dark dungeon room, Jonathan. They put me back here. Did they put you back? Who's the host of this show? Which shows. mother ever? I didn't know how to keep up with her. She's just very charming and I think she could probably get anybody to do anything if, if she if she wanted. She shoots money guns at us? in our meetings, like how dope is that? You know you have a good pitch if the money gun goes off. She was like, does anybody use Fitbit? And I said I did, and then she gave me a Fitbit, like a brand new Fitbit. She doesn't shoot things down. Like I feel like I have to be like the person who shoots things down, but maybe things don't need to be shot down. She's a good boss. <laughs> Energy, just general energy. I'm gonna say hustle. Positive. Dope. Fun. These aren't good words. Uh. Bouse. Powerful. Swag. Young. Decisive. Exuberant. Fresh. Super creative. A hustler. Hustler. Generous. Who are just to tell? Warm. Loving. Cool. Cool. I'm a dad. I have a son. I, uh, I'm not around cool people, but she's so young and I always feel old. This is my first writing job. I was terrified to pitch anything. And the head writer was like, yo, we're pitching our own ideas. I was like, shh. And I pitched an idea and Lily liked it and shot a money gun at me and that was awesome. Anytime the money gun goes off, it's like, that's when you know you've arrived. I messed up like printing out some scripts the other day and my old bosses would have flipped out. But Lily was just like, relax. But instead I like showed her my sweat stains and told her how anxious I was. And she was just like, it's not a big deal. We came in overnight and Lily had totally transformed our writer's room with like dope decorations and posters on the wall and most importantly, snacks. I think it's when she told us that like this was our show, like her name's on it, but it's like our show. It gave us the freedom to really like bring ourselves to it. The pitch sessions so far have just been so uh, positive and like there's no bad ideas and like every show I've ever worked on people are always like there's no such thing as bad ideas but then when a bad idea comes up they're like that is a bad idea and that has not happened and it's crazy and I never want that to change. I'm excited to see all the things that we come up with in the room come to life. I'm just so excited for this to air and for people to watch it. I think that we really get to do something totally new that hasn't been done before and she's so amazing and strong and funny that I think it's getting to work together and build the show is going to be dope. I'm just excited to see something different. I mean, we have such an opportunity to just kind of turn late night on its head and uh, there's never been uh, a host like Lily. I just can't wait to see her on every night. Like, I can't wait to see the rhythm she gets into. I can't wait to see what we do with the monologues. I'm really excited to write for a female host. Like, I think this is just like a fresh take. It's going to be, it's going to be hip as far as like late night goes. There's, I don't imagine there's too many late night shows that are going to be like this one. Has opened up a whole new world of possibilities from a different gender, my own gender. 
It's fun to write for Ben. No, it's not. No, it's just I hope Lily likes me. <laughs> I hope they said nice things about me. I hope my writers like me. You know what? I'm a big believer that happy people work the best. And I've said this before. So I love my writers. I have such a good time in our pitch sessions. I think they have great ideas. It has been a joy thus far, considering I've written almost everything of my life myself so far, to feed off of other people's energy in a pitch meeting and build on ideas together has been just so incredible. And also, like, all things aside, job, salary, everything aside, like, you like putting their time and energy into making art with me and that's like a huge honor so I'm so excited today we work 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 to end tomorrow we're gonna work 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 and I hope you're with me so together we can work 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 I hope you had a great day I can't wait till I can show you my set design because that that's gonna be the one